Hi beauties, how's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me, welcome back. So I'm going to do a tag video today. I am doing the Guilty Pleasures tag. And I was tagged by quite a few people for that one. Um, I was tagged by uh, Rockstar Mum, uh, Patty, and um, it's Tyler, duh. I got tagged by him, and then uh, Rosa uh, with Rosa Beauty Fashion, I was also tagged by her. So I'm going to go ahead and put their links down below if you would like to go and check them out if you're not subscribed to them and show them some love and you know check out their videos and everything. And um, so yeah, let's get started. I have this on my word pad, little, little word pad thing, that's how I copy mine actually. Uh, so that's kind of what I do anyway. Uh, so guilty pleasure tag. Okay, so the questions are TV show you love but should not confess to. So a TV show that I should not confess to. Um, I will probably have to go with, uh, I know like a lot of people talk about, you know, like the Real Housewives and things like that. Mine would actually probably be like something like ghost adventures and ghost hunters and things like that with the paranormal. I'm just all into that kind of stuff and intrigued with it. And um, as a matter of fact, uh, I like to do a lot of the bus tours uh, with one of the uh, bus uh, companies around here. Um, and they sometimes go uh, to some haunted places and I remember the one year I really really wanted to go to the Ohio State Penitentiary that's you know been closed for years and it's supposed to be haunted and all this stuff um, I wanted to go there because you know and um, you know haven't experienced that yet to go and do something like that but I would um, yeah so pretty crazy um, food you eat what? Hmm. I don't know if I actually really eat anything weird that I can really think of. Um, I know when I was when I was little, one of the things that uh, I used to get into, and I used to have my dad or my mom or somebody make me before. Like I was actually in. I was probably eight years old, and I was actually in bed. And I would actually be in bed and I wouldn't say every night but a good bit um, a lot of times I would want somebody to make me a ketchup sandwich and it would just be that it would be two slices of bread with ketchup uh, I don't eat that no more I don't know if I really could now but that was something that was very odd um, but something I could think of that I do that is kind of Odd. I mean, I wouldn't say it's a weird thing to eat, but I've done this since I can even remember. I will eat, I will eat like the outside around the, a slice of bread, like eat the crust, and then I would just take the rest of it and squish it in a ball. <laughs> and then eat it. I mean, I know it's nothing like really like crazy weird like I'm putting you know peanut butter and and pickle sauce or something on anything but it's just you know it I don't know so those are the only two things I can really think of one from my past and something I still do right now as of since I can even remember so uh, music I love and others just cringe at um, for me, I love music all over the wall. I really do. I really like a lot of different kind of music. I think the only one I've never been able to get into too much really is country, I'll be honest. Um, some of them are nice. I wouldn't say, it's just I haven't been able to get in, into it. I wouldn't, you know, knock it or anything like that. It's just I can't get into it myself. Um, but 
I do like a lot of different kind of music and I do love the rock music and I do love some metal music. I mean, I like Kill Switch Engaged. I mean, I'm sure some people are be like, what? You know, I, I don't know if anybody would know that um, group too well or, or not, but uh, Kill Switch Engage is like one of the ones that, you know, do a little more screaming. Um, Disturbed is one of my favorite kind of harder, like a metal kind of group, um, ACDC for old rock. Um, I've been to a lot of concerts, uh, but one of my true loves that I think some people, it's an acquired, it's an acquired um, taste in music, kind of like the acquired taste for food, would definitely be one of my big loves is techno and trance. And I've mentioned that many times, like, you know, Tiesto being my favorite DJ. DJ. I also love uh, Armin Van Buren, um, a lot of the Dutchies, I love a lot of the Dutchie DJs, as I always say, but uh, so if anything, maybe people would cringe at that because it's an acquired taste, but then again, so is some of the hard metal, so maybe between the two of them. Um, my guilty online habit, probably definitely my two habits would be um, shopping and just being uh, on YouTube all the time, like watching videos, uh, doing editing on my videos, any of that kind of stuff, my blog, um, just constantly doing those kind of things and shopping. So those would probably be two of my guilty pleasures for online. Um, I love to wear, but I shouldn't. Hmm. Uh, I love to wear, but I shouldn't. I don't know, because like... There's things I like, and I think they look really pretty, but I know for my own self they wouldn't look good. Um, and so I wouldn't really wear it anyway. I wouldn't go out and wear. But, um, hmm. <sighs> I don't know, really. I know for me, with the way my legs are, because I have severe venous stasis, I would so much love to wear high-heeled shoes and uh, short, like not real short skirts, but you know, shorter skirts like by the knee and above. But uh, I get to, I mostly like to wear sundresses and I don't even wear shorts anymore because yeah, I, my legs, I just get too embarrassed by my legs. I surely shouldn't because you know, who cares? I, I don't even know why I do really care. <laughs> Maybe this year might, I might change because I notice I, I get a little more, you know, eh, who cares? So probably like a dress, like a short dress or high heeled shoes. Probably mostly high heeled shoes because, yeah, the way my legs are. I would love to wear high heeled shoes because I've always loved. I will wear wedges once in a while, but not too high. But anywho. Um, movie you should not love so much, but you do. I would have to say the movie that there's a couple of them I can think of that I love. I don't know if I shouldn't love them because we, I mean, there's nothing wrong with loving certain kind of movies, but uh, one movie I love to watch and I have seen so many times, probably between the two of these, um, would be, one of them would be called uh, Eurotrip. Um, if any of you have ever watched Eurotrip, it, it's hysterical. It gets me every single time some of the stuff on there it just it is so funny i have watched it i lots of times it was just on a whim one time where i went ahead and rented it because you know i just thought oh sounds kind of interesting and i always liked those movies like porkies and the wedding uh american pie yeah american pie that's it um so yeah it kind of falls into that level for me too to a degree but I, I love that one and definitely definitely hands down I love the Pirates of the Caribbean anytime it's on TV any of them any of them it doesn't matter if it's one two three or four any of them I will watch them from wherever it's at it doesn't matter if it's in the middle towards the end just start whatever um, anywhere I, I watch it. I love Pirates of the Caribbean. That is probably a huge guilty pleasure, but it's that Johnny Depp and that Jack Sparrow that gets me every time. So, yeah. Uh, funny habit people comment on. 
the only comment or the funny habit that I can think of that, and especially my husband comments on, uh, I don't know if a lot of people comment. I never noticed myself doing this, never noticed it until he said something and now it's like one of the things where you catch yourself and you're like, oh my god, I really do do that, is um, my pinky. <laughs> He'll say it like I almost seem like I'm, I'm kind of posh or whatever, as he would say, because you know, he's from England. It's like, yeah, if I'm, if I'm drinking uh, tea or coffee or anything, or even when I'm typing on my keyboard, he says, you know, he says it's like my pinkies, like just want to you know, dangle up in there. I don't I never noticed it until he started saying it. I was like, oh, I start catching myself, you know, I'd be like, oh. you know, so yeah, that's one that I can think of. Um, I don't know who else notices it, but he sure did. <laughs> um, makeup look that you love, but is just so wrong. Probably the makeup look, and I would just say this is more for me, because I think any makeup look, if you can rock it, go for it. I mean, I don't think any, really any makeup look is wrong, in my opinion, because everybody likes different tastes, different styles, and all that kind of stuff. But, like, for me, something that I I do think that's um, really nice and sexy and everything else is, um, you know, like a lot of times when I see a lot of beauties, I'll put, like, uh, glittery sparkles like I really couldn't do that now because of the way with my eyelids I like some sparkle and some of the shimmery kind of stuff and I can get away with that but like as in like just the glitter uh, kind of pigment things and stuff like that I just think looks so gorgeous um, you know on so many uh, just some of the wild makeup looks that some of them do that you know, maybe in the corner here, they might put uh, a green or a blue instead of highlighting it there, you know. But, um, you know, if I was younger, I'd probably try and do it now. Uh, but now now I wouldn't be able to get away with it. So, and um, that's it. That's it for the tag. That's eight questions in it. So, um, I don't know who to tag in this video because so many people have done it but if you have not done this tag then I tag you and um, you can say that I tagged you in your video if you have not done that and, and you want to and you choose to do this tag by all means do it and say I tagged you and I think it's a lot of fun some of these tags and it's kind of interesting to hear what some of the people's answers are so that is it thank you so much um, thank you to all my new beauties who have been coming. I so much appreciate it, very much so. If you are not subscribed to my channel, I would love to have you. And just go ahead and click the subscribe button. It's free, no charge, of course, you know, and just come and join me each week. And I put up so many videos uh, a week and everything, um, just all over the place. And uh, if you like this video, please give it a good thumbs up. I'd so much appreciate it. It would also help me. And as always, beauties, please remember to be yourself, love yourself, and let the real beauty shine through. Until the next time, I'll take care and love you so much. Bye, everybody. Get me out of... I'm stuck. I am stuck in... I was going to say I'm stuck. Really good, you know.